I'll just tell Kiana about my pair of white runners. Actually, they're not white anymore. They're kind of like a brownish color. Anyways, before I came here, I was scrubbing them for two hours and they're still not clean. That reminds me of the sixth beatitude. Blessed are the pure in heart, for they shall see God. How? Well, let's say your shoes are a heart. Pure means clean. So what Jesus is saying is that the clean in heart will see God. How do you make your heart clean? Let's say your heart is dirty. I don't mean dirty as in filthy. <laughs> then what do you mean? I mean dirty like sinful. So if you watch a dirty movie, listen to bad music, read a bad book, yell at your siblings, make fun of someone and others, and makes your heart dirtier. And really, it shows you what is already in your heart because you are choosing to do these things. So that explains the pure in heart part, but what about the part that says, for they shall see God? The first thing I have to say is the dirtier your heart, the harder it is to hear what God is saying and see what he's doing. So when your heart is clean, it's easier to see God? Exactly. Well, I've watched loads of bad movies and thought lots of bad things. I guess that my heart isn't very clean, so how can I clean it? You can. What? Well, at least on your own you can't. That's why we need Jesus. I still don't understand. Let me show you an, an experiment to help explain. Hey everyone, welcome to my lab. Well, actually my kitchen. I have an experiment to help explain what I was talking to Grace about. This is our hearts. It's all clean, right? Well, maybe that's how we started. But once sin entered the world, it also entered our hearts. It's not so clean anymore. So, what kind of things makes our hearts dirty? You guessed it. Things like watching TV shows we shouldn't be watching. How about listening to bad music? You're right, that's also going to dirty our hearts also. Gossiping about our friends or talking or thinking about things that are not clean, pure, or holy. These things makes our heart cloudy. Remember, it's hard to see God through a cloudy, dirty heart. We can't clean our hearts by ourselves. We need Jesus. This cup is full of bleach. This represents Jesus. When we allow Jesus to come into our lives, that's when Jesus is allowed to begin our work in our hearts. Slowly, over time, as we become more and more like Jesus, our hearts become clean. He takes away our dirt. After we spend more time with him, learn to be more like him, our hearts become more like his. Try this experiment at home with your parents to better help you learn the importance of a pure heart and how it's only Jesus himself that can make our hearts clean. Our hearts clean now. Wow, now I get it. <sighs> but I wish God could clean my shoes.